Hello all. So welcome to the fourth development which is called emotional development. Emotional development is very very important development. It gives every child an idea to express themselves. Uh, if you know about Indian culture, Indian mythology, you must, all of you must be aware that there are around nine emotions. And in India, we call it Navras. So these nine emotions are there with everybody. But if you see the development in child, if you surpass or suppress any energy or any emotion, it has effect on the personality of a child. So in this development, I am telling you that give exposure to your child so that he expresses all his emotion to you. There is no good or bad emotion. All emotions are equally important and we should or it is our human right to be expressed, to be allowed to express. So you can see in this photo, you can see my two boys. Moksh is looking grumpy and Param is looking excited. So you have to see that you are allowing your own children to express all the nine emotions. So what are these nine emotions? So love, laughter. You are happy at times. You want to laugh. Let them laugh. Sorrow. You are upset. You want to, you don't want to talk to anybody. You want to be with yourself. That is sorrow. Love as it's stated. Love, to love people, to be in company. It's an emotion. Admire beauty. Courage. At times we are fearful. At times we are courageous. And courage is an innate quality which make human being humans. Then anger. We are angry with people. We are upset. We, are, we should be allowed to express our angerness. Terror or fear. At times we are fearful. We are afraid. We are fearful of ghosts. We, we can be fearful of a situation. We are terrified with the power with the future which uh, we are thinking of so fear let children embrace fear then there is disgust you simply don't like anything or you don't like somebody that's disgust and then there is awe and wonder surprise every child loves surprises Every child is born with that awe and wonder thing in them. So this emotion in this chapter, I'm going to tell you that how are we going to give our children an idea, a space where they can express all these nine emotions. There are huge, huge after effects if your child is not allowed for certain things they are not allowed at some families being upset is not allowed so what is so about it if i'm upset i'm upset it is we parents who have to teach our children that how to be angry how to be upset how to love how to be fearful how to be surprised, how to be courageous, how to laugh at things. We need to tell them it is okay if somebody laughs at us. So these are different emotions. In this chapter, I'm going to complete all the emotions and we will see in future, in further uh, chapters that what are the effects of these emotions if not allowed to express. Thank you.